Tiddles. Hey friends, my name is Tilly. For today's story time, I'm going to read you a book called Georgie Grows a Dragon by Emma Lazelle. Let's get started. Georgie was a girl who loved to grow flowers and plants. Each night before bed, she thought about what to grow next. But one night, as she slept, plop! Oh wow, I've grown a dragon! Georgie had never grown a dragon before. In fact, she didn't even remember planting one. And the dragon was nothing like her other plants. It was bigger, hungrier, and much more troublesome. This plant didn't want to be put in the sun. It didn't like its new soil, and it didn't even want to be watered. Hee <laughs> hee Bash! Smash! The dragon didn't make a very good house plant. It didn't even fit in the greenhouse. And the other plants made it... Sneeze! Ah! 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 Chew! <laughs> Excuse me. Oh, dragon. Why are you so difficult? I'll tell you why. It's because I've got a great big pot stuck on my butt and I am most definitely not, not, not a plant, he huffed. Once Dragon was unpotted, he was much less trouble. In fact, he was extremely friendly, very kind, incredibly practical, and super helpful when Georgie was late for school. But now that Dragon had popped out of his pot, he was keen to fly off to his family again. Both were sad to say goodbye, but they knew they'd always be friends. And anyway, Georgie seemed to have grown another new plant. The end. Thanks for reading today's story with me, friends. I'll see you next time. Bye!